A new day, a new project. I want to have an adapter for using this little microphone here with my XLR input from the sound card. And the point is that we have here around 48 volts. We need to keep the voltage down, but to have also the same volume and signals. And finally, after experimenting, of course, I have this uh, schematic working perfect. And this is the XLR. We have the hot 48 volts on the pin number two and that goes in series with a 150 kilo resistor. And here I'm gonna have 12 volts. This is absolutely okay for the microphone. And also bypassing the signal, uh, the audio signal, with an electrolytic of 10 micro on 50 volts. This schematic is working great, but let's put it on and let's try to make this running. Well, that's only theory, you know that. First of all, we have a XLR here. I'm gonna connect the cable. Okay, guys, a piece of advice here. To avoid any plastic deformation, just use this kind of uh, in out you know because that keeps the temperature under control don't let the plastic melt and uh, deform if not you're gonna ruin your xlr connector so we are connecting the ground and pin number three here and as long as i'm here okay the ground it's there okay very nice let me have number three on red good and number two on black this is not necessary but i'll use it anyway because i will do an xlr cable afterwards to use it with my equipment here okay this is looking good and strong let me connect this to my sound card input phantom off volume down and phantom on okay and now let's check about the voltages we should have around 48 volts here and of course we have 44.3 volts very nice let me have this little electric microphone connected first to the ground perfect let's try with a higher resistance oh by the way this electric microphones are supplied usually with 2.5 volts from uh, different sources you know like cameras or the computer input uh, this is one mega okay Okay, let's try on Mega, see what's happening. Number three, and the plus of the microphone. Let's connect the microphone, input, and let's check the voltages. 44, of course, and 80 millivolts here. That's not enough. We need at least 2.5 volts so one mega it's it's not good okay so let me have this one and this one should be 150 let's see 100 okay let's try 100 let's plug in the microphone voltages 42 here of course and 12 volts here that should be perfect so now i'm pretty sure it's working let's check this out let's check this out a little bit of gain hey yeah uh, hey hey yeah we oh man we can hear the sound okay let me recording video editor running let me open an audio track and the track is on well it's working but it's 
a lot of noise oh sorry let me try that in mono record input mono sapphire audio one here we are and i'm starting the recording so recording test recording the volume it's up 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 and here i am with maximum gain maximum gain and i suppose there is a lot of noise let me have my headphones so there as you can see i'm on maximum gain okay 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 stop let me go farther i'm taking out the microphone and i'm bypassing the resistor with this 10 microfarads on 50 volts capacitor of course plus to the input okay it's done let me plug in the microphone let's start recording and i'm half of the gain like before and it's already a huge difference isn't that okay do we have a difference here of course we have if i go even farther i can see it on the screen oh man now this is really working this is really working okay here we go so finally that's the idea i'm stopping this let me have the schematic once again very simple 150 kilo ohms okay i used 100 here well that's not a rule i think 150 it's working too so very simple schematic easy to be done and you have a microphone for your sound card so here we are this is the final result we have an adapter here it's looking very nice compact and let's plug this in this goes to my sound card let me have the microphone in and that's the microphone over there i'm starting the recording right here yes and we start recording now a little bit of gain there we go there we go so now it's recording through this little lavalier microphone i'm usually using for doing my recordings on the camera okay so thank you for now i hope it's useful if you like please subscribe and comment See you soon with some other projects and the most important thing, don't forget to have fun. Bye bye.